okay so in this video we are going to install vmware workstation professional edition we already download vmware workstation if you did not download yet so you can download from this link and you can use this key to register so let's go to uh, desktop i already put vmware workstation full 16.2 and double click on this one okay so it will ask you user account control just click yes next thing it will try to install okay so let's see the next tip is it will show you this window okay you just need to click next and you need to accept the term of license agreement so it's coming up it's preparing to install yeah it's come up click just next accept the term and license agreement click next okay this is the location where you want to install and click next okay this is the um, check for update okay and if you want to join so just click next it will create shortcut on desktop and also on start menu so click next okay and install so this was so easy just click next 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 and you can install easily so i accept the agreement and after that enhance keyboard driver and also the path where to install vmware workstation and then i click next this one is check for update and also to help improve vmware workstation pro you need to share the logs and each and everything with vmware if you don't want you can uncheck this one okay next thing it will create a shortcut on desktop and also on start menu so we say yes and click next okay and it will start the installation click on install so we already click on install so it will uh, try to install and later on it will show you the license and finish button so just click on finish and you can register i already give you a key to register with that key and also you can use um trial one okay i want to mr workstation uh, for 30 days so you can use them for 30 days as well so it's going to install yet okay and then you can open it and then we will install eve ng and in this vmware workstation so that's why we need this vmware uh, workstation 16 which is a professional edition so it's done now let's go to license and let me go up copy the key to register so let me register and click enter so now it's done and if we go to desktop so there should be shortcut of vmware workstation as well because we created desktop shortcut as well so let's see now if we go back to desktop so still we don't have because it, sometimes it's required to restart okay the system then you can use them but anyway it was so easy to install so let's go to program file and let's go to check out vmware workstation is there or not okay i need to go to program file this one and let's check out here so i cannot see vmware workstation yet i hope so it's installed and maybe it will take some time to show up yeah here is vmware okay and this is vmware tool and everything is okay i believe okay and after a while from startup you can uh, run them and also from desktop also you can use to run them okay it will create a shortcut here after a while so this was the procedure how we can install vmware workstation and window 10 either in window 11 or window 8 or window 7 the procedure is similar for all these windows so we put the key and register and then you can open from startup either from shortcut on the desktop